Director for the Vernacular Music Center at Texas Tech University. This is another short bodywork tutorial designed to give you a break in the day, get you moving, give you some tools for taking care of yourself right now. So this one actually comes from the Feldenkrais Method, but I actually originally learned it as a warm-up for a dance class, and it's a really great one. You can think of it as kind of rinsing your spine out in a way. Um, it's a great one to take a break from a computer, to take a break from sitting. It's also really nice to do first thing in the morning, and you can actually do it right in bed without even getting up. So, I have a yoga mat. You can do it on your bed, of course. Um, towel, blanket, something that maybe gives you a little cushioning since we're going to be on the floor. I'm going to start on this side, and I'll do the other side as well. I'm going to extend my left hand out. And I'm going to fold the right hand, kind of giving the pillow for my cushion. I'll show you what that looks like. Some people also find it comfortable to turn their head one side or the other. And then what we're going to do with the arm that's folded, which is my right arm, I'm going to fold the right knee up as well. And you're just going to stay here, take a few breaths, release into the floor. And you want to leave your knee about where it is, but extend that leg out. And then we're going to roll over, keeping one arm on the ground, and the other arm that was folded is going to kind of move all the way around. So you move onto your back. You can adjust the arms depending on your space to keep them further out to the side or a little bit further up, especially if you have shoulder tension, that arm that floats all the way up and over might not be able to reach all the way to the side. So find wherever you need to place it so it's released, it's relaxed, you're not holding tension. And just kind of feel it out for yourself. And again, we're just gonna take some breaths you should feel a spiral in the back. You might feel uh, even the, the, the hips, low back, shoulders opening a little bit. And you're just finding that spiral again in your spine, especially if we're all sitting in front of our computer. Sometimes you lose that full range of motion in the, in the spine. And that's just what we're exploring with this one. After you stay in here for a few breaths, you're going to take that arm that was open and just float it back and that pulls you back onto your stomach. So now we're going to do the other side, right arm out, left arm folded, and left knee folded up. Just a few breaths, releasing into the ground. And then when you're ready, you're going to extend that left leg out. Leave that right arm on the floor, but let the left arm float up and over. Breathe into that spiral. Again, adjust your arms as needed. This is a great way to wake up the spine or to find that spiral movement that range of motion in your spine if you've been sitting a long time. And then when you're ready, just rewinding that motion, the left arm floating up, the left leg bending. Just roll back onto your stomach and up you come. So I hope that was a helpful little stretch to get you going, it's again, it's a great one to do first thing in the morning or taking a break from the computer. It just helps us to remember that we are a three-dimensional being. Sometimes when we're locked onto the screen, we kind of focus always forward. And so reminding ourselves that we have that spiral capability in our spine can be a really healthy thing to introduce into our lives. So I hope that was a great break and take care.